Hello everyone, welcome to week three of Bolt League. It is I, Alex, coach of the York White Roses. And today I'll be battling Cramp of the Montana McGinnians. So let's see if he's searching now. Um, so yeah, so before we jump right in, this is my team. Uh, Iron Bundle, Ursaluna Blood Moon, Young Mega, Toxapex, Blue Leaf, and Flygon. Oh, opponent found. I am using Terra Electric Flygon, Cramp is using Terra Water Raging Bolt, and Terra Normal Dun Dun Sparse. And to be honest, when I was building this team, I low-key forgot that Raging Bolt can Terra, so this will be interesting. That might be pretty difficult to deal with. But actually I'm glad he went water because Bayleaf is my special wall this match, so that really helps Bayleaf wall it and actually dish out good damage with Giga Drain. So I have special wall Bayleaf, physical wall Toxapex, um, just boots, special attacker Yanmega, special attacker Ursaluna, standard boots Iron Bundle, and then Dragon Dance, Flag on Terra Electric. So my team's a little bit standard this week. Um, not as offensive as I usually do, but let's see how it goes. And he has Raging Bolt, Qian Pao, Jadon Sparse, Screamtail, Tauros, and Petulant. So also kind of a little bit of a bulky team on his side. Um, I think I'll lead Yan Mega and scout out, maybe just press U turn, see what he leads. Nothing on this team really likes taking a Blood Moon to the face from Ursaluna, so I plan is to kind of try and pivot into that and hit something hard. Although, especially defensive Scream Tail could be very annoying. I know Scream Tail. Okay. Hmm. So, if he's leaving Scream Tail, he's probably gonna press rocks and set up rocks, which is fine. My two things that are weak to rocks both have boots. Um, so I think I U-turn into Ursaluna. There's nothing a Scream Tail can really do to an Ursaluna. I think it's a bit too early to start setting up with Flygon. Um, I'm going to go into Toxic and press Toxic, but I think it's fine to just scout out and see how much damage I can do. Okay, it's faster when it's on the road. So the thing has speed investment. That's a bit annoying. I could have just hard switched into Ursulina, but that's fine. Hmm. Now it'll probably go for Rock. I think it's still fine for me to press U-turn here. If he switches, then I get that pivot off. Wish, okay. It's a little annoying. Okay, the damage makes me think this is special defensive, but we'll see of course. It's honestly not a bad option for me to go into Flygun here. But again, I think it's just a bit too early to start setting up. Hmm. Yeah, let's just go for Ursuluna here. Ursuluna can get paralyzed, of course, early, so this isn't a bad option here. That's the funny news, but then... Wow. That actually blew out range. This offensive screen turn. So I don't like that. I'm gonna go for Moonlight. Encore. Oh, that's annoying. So 
this thing is Encore, Wish, Thunder Wave, and Psychic. Maybe it works that way. Oh my god. That's wild. Okay, new interaction learned. Don't Encore and Ursaluna into Blood Moon. You will regret it. Let's see if I can use it again here. I don't know if I'm gonna struggle here. That's weird. I can take another Psychic to the face. I really just want to get this annoying thing in here. I do have Moonlight so I can... If I get a chance to heal, that would be nice. This is not my chance. I do a vacuum wave on this thing, but there's a very real possibility he just presses Ice Shard and then it's not your Selena Gone. Plus I have physically defensive tox effects, so might as well use it. Psychic Pants, oh. I forgot it learns that. Wow, this is not good. Oh, that's a lot of damage. I don't think I want Top Specs to die here yet because having it for the Tauros is pretty useful. I don't think I need the Omega anymore. Yeah. Sorry, Omega. Is Dindin Spice. Yeah. There's probably gonna be Dindin Spice here. Yep. I wonder if it's especially defensive. Well, I'm gonna miss anyways. Whatever. Hmm. I'm not sure what, thing, what this thing's gonna do. I'm gonna switch an Ursaluna. But I don't know. Because there's a very real chance this thing presses Thunder Wave as well. I could go into Flygon. I think Ursuline as a switch for when Petra is in. So I think that would be a free heal. Body Slam. Okay, yeah, it's very dangerous. Oh, there it is. If I didn't get paralyzed there, I could have Terra Electric. And then I wouldn't have been paralyzed at all. Oh, we can turn ground. Uh, 
Okay, I am not going to Terra because it would not be fair of me to say the wrong Terra type and be like, surprise, I'm actually Terra Ground. I really did mean to be Terra Electric, and it's kind of too late at this point anyway, so I'll just press a fake, try and get some damage. I'm still faster after the Terra, that's pretty good. Boil. Body slam, roost, something. I feel like I need to go for a dragon dance here. I do have haze on toxic pets at least. I have haze on toxic. Maybe I just go for the crit. One. I think that's the best one with a plus two body slam and full physical defense. So I'm either toxic or he was here first. I think I'll toxic first, put him on the timer. Zen headbutt? Oh my god all the psychic coverage on this thing. Really? Wow. I'm just gonna lose to Serene Grace. Try and lock him into clear with Iron Bundle. I think that's my intention. I can go for the Toxic one more time. Probably not playing optimally at this point, but I'm pretty annoyed by this thing. I, uh, yeah, I messed up earlier. I should have switched to Iron Bundle right as soon as he roosted. I'm poured him into roost. Just stalled his PP out. Okay, he went for the third. Now this thing's on the timer. Mm -hmm. I need Tox Bucks to be alive still. Mm -hmm. I don't want to sacrifice Bailey. I don't know if I want Ursula to die yet either. Oh, 
this thing can do a lot of damage, so I feel like it has attack investment. I can just go for the synthesis here. Wait, how fast am I? Okay, I'm gonna do a quick some quick mod. So Bailey has base 60 speed on a minus speed nature. The gun sparse has Fifty-five speed. So he's probably not speed to me. I can try it though. Okay, that's not good. Gosh, I'm not going for the minus speed nature. It's actually really bad. <laughs> Toxpix live two body slams. That's the question, isn't it? So I think with the poison plus the rocky helmet damage, he dies here. I and mean, my other option is I sacrifice Ursulina. So just kill with Iron Harper. This is really bad for me. If he's smart, he'll just go into Raging Bolt here. Taurus, okay. I think we can both Either way, I just press freeze dry. He doesn't really have a switch in for this. Okay, it's fine. Yeah, it's like it is. can somehow live a close combat. It would be great, but I don't think. How do you feel? Touch him? Okay. Yeah. Probably a parting shot or something here. I have to hard switch in there or something, you know, in the case he presses the ghost or poison me. Oh, 
The Dunsparce was such a pain. <laughs> oh my god. Okay. Well, that's week three done, so thank you all for watching, and I will see you next week for week four against someone. I don't know who it is yet, but see ya.